ReCoffee has rolled out a campaign in support of a green and sustainable world. The focus is a global conversation around sustainability, repurposing and the importance of creating a generation that is environmentally conscious. In addition to this, they have repurposed the tins to carry out this initiative. But for more on this, we chat to Nicole Roos, the Business Executive Officer, Coffee and Beverages at Nestle South Africa. Nicole, a very good morning to you and a warm welcome to Morning Live. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank you again for having me. Do tell us more about this initiative in greater detail, Nicole. Yeah, thank you. I mean, at Nestle, we uh, really understand that at the heart of good food is, of course, the quality of our ingredients. And, of course, the people that produce them, uh, the soils in which they are grown, and the ecosystems that support them. And uh, at Nestle, we believe it's so important that the growers and the environments are indeed protected. And this requires that we would then need to know exactly where our ingredients come from and mm -hmm. how they are produced, and to ensure that they're also produced in a way that minimizes any negative impacts on uh, on the environment so of course um, it was uh, it was quite easy for South Africa's most beloved uh, chicory and coffee mixture to really lead the way and uh, we've been driving what we call a hundred percent responsibly sourced coffee beans uh, to ensure that we play our part uh, to contribute for for future generations and how do you think this is relevant to ordinary South Africans yeah, I think, you know, for South Africans, um, this, this consciousness about sustainability is becoming more and more, uh, more, more topical. And I think for ordinary South Africans, we want to know a bit more about the awareness of our supply chains and how we source our products, where these products uh, are made. So I think that demand is indeed starting to grow. And uh, we want to know that products are sourced ethically and that we've taken care uh, and upheld uh, a lot of the elements within the supply chain process. So I think for us... Uh, uh, responsibly sourced is, is exciting. I think for, for a few of your listeners, they're probably thinking, you know, what is responsibly sourced coffee? Um, interestingly, it's that we know where 100% all of the coffee can be traced back to an identified farming group, uh, which means that we are, are recognized then at a certain sustainability standard. And that's also verified uh, by both third party uh, uh, partners that we use in our network. So exciting for South Africans. Um, along the same veins, uh, we've also decided to launch what we call a re-campaign. Um, again, what, what is this? Uh, this is a wider Nestle initiative uh, to start to look at uh, bigger sustainability initiatives and we believe South Africa is really ready. Uh, these are strategies that we really want to work, uh, we've been working obviously for many years, but to bring these together and allow South Africa to work on a paradigm shift, you know, rethink, uh, reduce, reuse, repurpose. So uh, yes, South Africa can, pl can play a part and uh, exciting because we can make an impact on, on our planet. Is this only being introduced in South Africa or has it been rolled out in other parts of the world? Yeah, so for the longest time, in fact, um, this year Nestle is celebrating its 10-year anniversary of the Nescafe plan. So no, it's, uh, it's, it's not just South Africa, uh, it is in the wider context. And really what that plan is, uh, it's, uh, it's a, a manifestation of supporting the, the, the farmer, the community, and of course in the context the wider planet. So with about uh, 230 international agronomists, we actually support the farmer, uh, we educate and train them and, and allow for knowledge transfer to, to, to happen in, in the coffee plantations. So very much an international drive, uh, but really South Africa embracing it. Uh, and we're really happy that South Africa's most loved coffee brand can now proudly say that 100% of our coffee beans are indeed uh, responsibly sourced. And tell us more about the repurposed tins, I mean, the new design and its features. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. And I think this is a new, uh, you know, not a new concept, but be really being able to repurpose. And okay. um, one of the design elements of the re-campaign is exactly that, you know, what can we repurpose? What can we reuse? And for many South Africans, that tin is so iconic, right? We've grown up with it, a uh, spoonful of memories uh, in every tin. And what we're loving is consumers are starting to find really awesome ways, creative ways um, of utilizing their tins uh, throughout the home. You know, we, we're seeing um, planting tins, we're seeing pencil case holders, we're seeing general storage utility, and we're just encouraging South Africans to express that creativity and, of course, repurpose and, and reuse. 
Now, Nicole, the concept of repurposing packages is not new to us in the African context. I mean, I wouldn't throw away a tin. We would just use it to, to cook when we were playing house as kids or plant in it. I mean, it's always been reused. So how are you hoping this initiative will carry this on? Yeah, and I think it's about uh, that wider sustainability trend, you know, just really creating a consciousness um, to really allow consumers to rethink, uh, to reduce, to repurpose or reuse. And I think, you know, the, the tin element for us, as you said, it, it is a bit of natural behavior. We want to heighten consciousness and play our part as South Africa's leading coffee brand and, and ensuring that the tins are indeed part of a, of a wider memory and part of a wider network. So, again, uh, using some of the power of, of existing behavior and to allow South Africans to think a little wider and then really apply uh, that repurposing behavior in all facets of their life, be it from, from clothing uh, to food to, to storage containers as you, as you outlined. And how can people be a part of this initiative? Yeah, I think, you know, we uh, we were saying earlier in the week that um, it's just such a crucial thing that South Africa also become more aware of where their products are sourced and, you know, are they aware of their responsibly sourced supply chains? I think we are seeing South Africans really start to demand uh, that sourcing, sourcing uh, visibility. So check your labels, be responsible and, and really look out for the brands um, that are, are leading the way. Uh, and most importantly, we know that South Africans take pride uh, in enjoying every sip uh, of coffee and just by supporting that you know you know that your coffee beans in there are 100% responsibly sourced so um, exciting times ahead and as we said this is a journey uh, but really welcoming South Africans uh, together with Nescafe Rick Coffee uh, to walk a journey on on 100% sustainably sourced beans with us mm. and are you confident that it'll change the way people look at coffee and especially drinking Rick coffee yeah, you know, coffee is a real burgeoning culture at the moment. Uh, we really are seeing, uh, you know, really strong growth in the coffee uh, segment overall. Um, and we know as Nestle that we need to play our leadership part. So, you know, for, for many instances, um, sustainability is about making commitments and about following through on those commitments. And so at Nestle, we believe, you know, really using the power of our leading brands to, to lead the way when it comes to sustainability is our responsibility and, and one, of course, that we, we take very seriously. Seriously. So exciting again, as we said, you know, Rick Coffee's in so many homes. Um, what a beautiful way to start to, to lead our re-campaign by this 100% responsibly sourced uh, coffee solution for Nescafe Rick Coffee. All right, Nicole, great chatting to you. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you again for having me. Have a great day. You too, Nicole. Thank you. We just spoke to Nicole Roos, Business Executive Officer, Coffee and Beverages at Nestle South Africa on their new campaign in support of a green and sustainable world. Let's take a quick break. We'll be back shortly.